Hi everyone, my name is Lisa Ryan and I'm a local Thermix consultant in Coffs Harbour. Today I'm going to show you how to safely transport your TM6. Now that many of us are going on holidays within Australia and we're using our Thermix on holidays, going camping, caravanning or just taking it to your holiday spot, it's really important that you protect your Thermix and the scales when you're travelling. So I'm going to show you how to put it into transportation mode and then I'm also going to show you how to safely pack your Thermix into the travel bag. Many of you were given the opportunity to get the travel bag as a gift with purchase but if you don't have one of these, you can purchase them from the mix shop as well. So with your TM6, the best way to pack it is to put as much as you can in the bowl first. So I'm going to take the lid off and we're going to put our steaming basket into the bowl. And then I'm going to put the measuring cup inside the steaming basket to take up more space as well. And then I'm gonna pop the lid on. And then I'm gonna put the splash guard in place as well because that will all hold together once we activate the transportation mode and the arms will lock everything into place. So on your TM6 screen, just go to the three lines up in the top left-hand corner and then go to settings and then just scroll down to transportation mode. And then you simply wanna press activate. Then the arms will be locked into place and now all we need to do is turn our Thermomix off. So just holding the selector and then your Thermomix will shut down. So what we're gonna do with the travel bag is your travel bag will come with an insert in the front. So this piece here will actually sit this way because you have one scale in the front and two in the back feet. So you simply put that in and then your Thermomix can sit into place. So always remember when you're moving the Thermomix that you need to lift it and not drag it across the bench. So you're gonna lift your Thermomix and then you're going to put it into the carry bag. Before we put the machine into the bag, we're actually going to just pop the cord back into the back of the machine. So just push it in. It's important to always have the cord fully extended when you're using the Thermomix, but for travel purposes to take up less space, just pop it into the back. Okay, so to pop your Thermomix in the bag, we just wanna safely lift it. So putting your hand here and your other hand underneath the front and just sitting it there nicely so that the scales sit in the bag in their correct spots. Now, uh, this side we also have two pockets. So one for the butterfly whisk, which can sit in there. And then one for your spatula. So just pop your spatula in there. Okay, and then it's just a matter of zipping that one up and you've also got a Velcro latch at the front. Okay, and then in the side pocket, that's perfect to fit our Varoma. So I've just got my Varoma tray in the middle there and your aroma just slides down the side. And just zip it up. We've got two handles here with a Velcro piece that make it nice and easy to carry your Thermomix. And there you're ready to go on your trip so that your Thermomix will be nice and safe in the car. When you get to your destination, all you need to do is take your Thermomix out. And once you turn on your Thermomix, it will actually deactivate the transportation mode. So I'm just gonna lift it out now. Just pull your cord back out again. And just press the selector button on. And as you can see, it will automatically deactivate the transportation mode and unlock the arms for you so you can go ahead and take all of your pieces out of the bowl. I hope that helps so that you can safely transport your TM6. You can also do that with the TM5 as well. Um, if you have any questions at all, don't hesitate to contact me. You can find me on my social media pages, Lisa's Thermomix Cooking Journey, on both Facebook and Instagram. Thank you.